Yeah, so it doesn't waste it all the time. It doesn't waste it all the time. Yeah, so it drops it all into there. <coughs> all turning? Right, all turning. Turn about moving mass, wouldn't they? <laughs> <laughs> what is it, Jack? Uh, 29 or 30. Right. Yeah. So you know you're on the right stroke. Yeah. Because it's open the... Yeah. So there isn't a mark up here. No. No, no. So that is, that, yeah, that's what that mark is supposed to be arresting. So when, when you stop it, you're supposed to stop it with the with that pointing down. So any excess oil in there goes into the bearing, so it keeps it replant, keeps yeah. oil in there. Because yeah. normally it's run every day. Yeah. So by overnight, it will still have plenty of oil yeah. in there. But time we do. That's why I always put some into the ring oil as well, just to make sure we've got. So that valve is shut, it's now from pressure. Leave the fuel off until we get some speed on it. Yeah. <coughs> so I don't use that now, we've we, we packed it into the ground. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know how many actually built these, but 
week, the, uh, it seems to go from the gas. We, we stopped making the gas and we really concentrated on the So there was a, a lot of them once upon a time. It's actually trying to work against the compression. Because, because we're on the airline, it's not, it's not working against an empty bottle. It, it won't easily. You can only pull out into drive, recharge your bottle. If you made a cock of it and empty your air bottle, there's this Villiers engine, you have to put, put the belt onto there, start that. But well, that takes about two hours from there. 